this retrofit is uh, doing a shoebox right here, typical shoebox for a car, car lot or a thousand watt metal halide, which is right here. What you need to do is before we do this, that's the ballast, is we need to measure the inside ID of the existing shoebox so we can make up our plate to put our LED retrofits and drivers on that will fit right into this shoebox. So basically what the electrician does, he goes up and he guts the entire shoebox taking out the, the reflector plate, the light itself, and the ballast, leaving us an empty shoebox just like this. When we're done with that, the plate gets made and it comes to the, the job site and the electrician basically guts everything and sticks it right inside here and installs it in probably 20 minutes and you're done. This is a typical shoebox for a thousand watt metal halide. This one is going in a car lot. Here's the new plate with the three LEDs on it. We're taking the glass plastic covers off of them. They get taken off before the install gets done. And then the plate will go up and be fastened into the existing shoe box and powered up and done and move on to the next one. The electrician is coming down now. He's getting ready to pick up the next retrofit plate and take it up to the uh, unit up there that's open. And the retrofit plate will fit right into that and he'll power it up. And then we'll move on to the next one. Contractor has the plate. As you can see, he's putting it down into the existing shoebox. It's one of the things you have to do. We have to make sure the dimensions are correct so the plate fits right in. matter of fastening the plate to the existing shoe box, wiring it up, and he's done. Electrician's up, We're working on the last one. He's going to take this one apart. Probably 10 minutes to do that, and another 10 15 minutes to put the retrofit plate in. Uh, the third and final light is ready to go. Got it all taken out and we're ready to put the new light in. Okay, the third unit's finished. And uh, the electrician will be coming down shortly and we'll turn them on tonight and see what they look like.